Clill Test 1 Listening Exercises 6 and 7 Good morning. We're here with Dr. Todson, our nutritional expert. Good morning, Albert. It's a pleasure to be here this morning. Our pleasure. Dr. Todson, could you please give some suggestions to our listeners about healthy eating habits? Yes, of course. First of all, it is important, if you want to have a healthy diet, to have variety. The best meals must contain foods from different groups. Could you give us some examples? Of course. Well, first of all, half of your meal should be vegetables and fruits, and about one quarter should be pasta or rice. The other one quarter should be proteins, like meat, fish, legumes, cheese or eggs. What about drinks, Dr. Todson? I know that many of our teenage listeners love sugary drinks like Coke or orange juice. Sugary drinks are not good for our health. Research found that teenagers drink soda and sugary drinks three times more than in 1978. These sugary drinks contribute to excessive weight and obesity. Even 100% fruit juice contains only sugar and no fiber. Teens should drink low-fat milk or water with a slice of lemon or orange. Dr. Todson, what about the quantities? How much food do teenagers have to eat a day? Well, it depends on the physical activities they do. But as a general rule, it is better to avoid oversized portions because people today eat more than they need to. An example, in 1980, a bread roll had 140 calories. Now. It has 350 calories. When you eat too much, you take in more calories than your body can burn. And for that reason, you are likely to become overweight. What consequences can obesity have? A great number of medical problems, such as high blood pressure, bone problems, sleeping problems, and many others.